hello everyone and welcome to the channel in this video guys i'm going to guide you how you can troubleshoot this issue we can't find your camera and the error code you can see here error code could be different in your system but the video i'm going to show you how you can troubleshoot this issue step by step so this issue mainly occurs when your hardware of camera is not attached or the bios driver is not updated or the camera driver is not updated and sometime it may occur due to the incorrect permission on your windows so first we will try to resolve this issue with the permissions so let's close this and you need to make sure that the camera access is allowed on your windows open settings and on the left hand side you need to click on privacy and security and once you do the this you need to scroll down and look for your camera similar steps you need to follow on windows 10 and make sure the camera access is on like this okay it should be on and now check back if you are able to see the error is gone or not just open that up if the error is still occurring so we have to move on to the next method that is the device manager simply open the device manager and you need to make sure that the camera driver is listed here this is the primary step since the if driver is not listed here it means that it is not at attached on your windows so if it is not attached on your windows click on your computer host name <coughs> then click on action then you need to click on scan hardware changes now if you see your camera here so you need to update the driver here if still not visible just click on view and show hidden devices now the camera is if still not visible here let me show you in my different computer how it should be looking like so this is my another computer if I open the computer and the device manager you can see here camera should be look like this integrated webcam so you need to right click on it just disable it once and once you disable it the down arrow key you can see from here right click on it and simply enable this okay once you enable the camera it should work now if it is gray out and sometime I have seen that the integrated webcam is gray out and you are not able to perform the steps like updating drivers or choosing the different way to update the driver here it remains same so that's I have shown you in the another computer so if the issue is still persist we can run the troubleshooter setting and we need to find out other troubleshooter and you can see here camera just run the camera troubleshooter and see if that is able to fix our issue or not most of the cases the troubleshooter will not fix your issue since the driver is itself not available in the device manager but you can still try this out if that helps or not so it is asking to log in but I don't want to log in so we have to follow the next method so guys if all the troubleshooting setting fail on your windows so we can go to the manufacturer website and we need to install some drivers simply you need to open any website and you need to open the CMD so that we can get the serial number of the laptop or system type it WMIC BIOS get serial number press the enter key and just you need to copy this and system information 
you can look for the manufacturer or the model number or the motherboard accordingly let me dial drivers just click on drivers you need to just copy and paste the serial number here and in the manufacturer website guys you need to look for the BIOS driver okay look for select driver and you need to look for BIOS this is very important driver this helps the hardware and software to connect on your laptop or system click on selected download check the latest driver one the system driver and BIOS driver now once you have downloaded the BIOS driver just plug in with the charger and double click on the setup BIOS.exe and just run your system to the BIOS driver so once you double click on the BIOS driver it will stop prompt next 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 and it will ask you to restart your windows and you have to restart your windows after that and after waiting for 10 5 to 10 minutes it will automatically log in in some time your window screen may stuck or maybe black you don't need to do anything just plug in with the charger and after that check back if you are able to get your integrated camera here or not if your integrated camera is st still not available here so you can check for update drivers once just install the app of manufacturer and this will install all the pending drivers on your windows and also make sure you go to check for update and install all the pending update on your windows sometime windows update can cause the issue click on check for update and make sure you are using the latest windows check for update and it should solve the problem if nothing works on your windows so you can power flush your system how to power flush your system just remove all the external cables from your computer or system and press and hold the power button for 30 seconds then leave your system for 1 to 2 minutes then just plug in with the battery or charger or the system power cord and turn it on again and see if that fix the issue or not if after applying these methods nothing works for your windows then you have to replace the hardware of the integrated camera and you need to go to the repair shop if nothing works on your windows or you can reset your PC before going to shop or reinstall the windows so this is how guys you can fix the issue so I hope this video helps you if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching